For me, precision medicine is having access to the technology that I need that allows me to live a free life um, or as free as possible uh, from the burden of thinking of diabetes. For me it's about making life easier for different people living with diabetes because we are not all the same. Precision medicine in diabetes is important uh, to reduce error in medical uh, decision making. Uh, so the first level of precision in diabetes would be type 1, type 2, lack of incident or lack of effect of incident, but uh, that's way too little uh, precision in, in, in that characterization of diabetes. This is the third time we're arranging this uh, meeting with the European Foundation for the Study of Diabetes. Um, it's a concept we've uh, developed over time uh, where we have brief presentations from experts followed by a facilitated uh, discussion where we were also involving uh, people with uh, disease uh, the so-called lived experience to facilitate uh, the discussion with other experts. It's a fantastic opportunity to share ideas and network with people both inside and outside of the field and I really love the opportunity to also engage with people living with diabetes and to hear what their priorities are. It's important for me to take part in these kinds of symposiums, uh, to have the lived experience have a voice in the room so that we don't get stuck in our silos and that we have an eye for what really matters. I think that researchers have a big role uh, making sure that great ideas don't stay as a secret, but reaches as many people as possible. Getting the feedback from people living with diabetes is a very important part of that. The Novo Nordisk Foundation will continue to push precision medicine into diabetes uh, medicine uh, through much of what we do for our other areas, uh, supporting career programs, project grants, uh, but also initiatives and meetings such as this.